Okay, we are going to see the assignment for the topic variables and data types. If you would like to watch the videos for this topic before starting the assignments, the links are given in the description box. Our team was really excited to see that many of you had submitted your first assignment. Keep up the good work and continue to do more assignments. Some of you had sent messages to us that you could not submit the assignments because you were getting errors in your code and so you could not get the output. We want to tell you that you can submit the assignment even if there is error in your code. We will correct the error and we will also send some tips to fix such errors so that you can easily learn how to fix the errors if you get them again. So please submit the assignments even if you are not able to get output. That is also the same reason why we ask you to submit the code instead of the output so that we can look at your code and fix it for you. Now for this assignment we are going to write a short essay using variables and print statement. Let me show you an example. Remember we wrote an introduction about us when we were learning about print statements. Now I am going to print my introduction again but this time I will use variables to store the values. I am going to create four variables name, hobby, job and experience. So I write name is equal to within single quotes ani hobby within single quotes play basketball job is equal to product director and finally experience is equal to 16. Now I wrote print statements to print print my name is Ani print I love to play basketball in my free time again print I am a product director and I love my job and then again print I have 16 years of work experience so if you notice like how we discussed in our previous video I have put percentage s wherever we want to print the values and the variable within the brackets so the value of these variables will be printed in the place of percentage s or percentage d so let me save the file and run the code so the values from the variables are printed in these print statements so now for your assignment you are going to create four variables name age hobby and subject favorite subject basically so and then you're going to print the following statements my name is blank i am blank years old i like to you know whatever you like to your hobby is i like to listen to music play basketball collect coins whatever you want to write and blank is my favorite subject so you can write anything max english science social history anything so the value of your variables should be printed in the places that i have given blank remember we had fill in the blanks in our textbook and we wrote the correct answers in the blank spaces now we are going to write code to print the values instead of the blank spaces very exciting right i am waiting to see the code you are going to write write the code and submit the assignments if you want to know how to submit the assignment please see the video on how to submit assignments i have given the link in the description box i will see you soon with a new topic